everybody welcome back Ruben with Texas all water fishing and just had a few phone calls from and a few texts from a couple friends of mine it looks like the surf is green it's a little flat today it's not like super clean super clean the winds overnight should allow the surf to flatten up and clean up and clear up just a little bit more to give that blue water that clean water that clear water that we want to see when we are looking for those trout and maybe even jacks maybe with spanish mackerel traveling in some of that cleaner water so keeping my fingers crossed let me get my gear together and hopefully in the morning i'm going to be out there and able to capitalize on some of that clean water so can will the clean water will the blue water be back fingers crossed Hopefully, it will be. Hard head. Feel like a hard head. Think so. Cheap it. There we go. Got that guy. Little guy. Little black drum. So that's gonna do it the seawall for us a lot of times what happens you are you won't be catching anything around that particular rock groin so it's always a good idea to jump on another rock groin and see if you can see if you can hook up but in this case you know we're just gonna move on down mosey on down the road there's another spot that we want to hit a uh, private dock that I want to hit so we're gonna hopefully hopefully we'll run into some smoke up Hopefully we run into some bigger fish and we get off all these little guys, but I think Eric caught one slot drum and that was it. I, so we saw one nice red get caught, about 27 inch red. So we were out there, I guess around three hours. So yeah, maybe about two and a half hours. So we'll call it, move on to the next spot. I, I, I left it in. What do you got? I left it. It was underneath the duck. I know the catfish. I can, I can tell. No, it's not a catfish. That's a catfish. No, it's not. Oh, no. Okay. You well, are the drum cool. master. Give it to me. We are! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Throw that football. He swallowed the doo doo out of that. He swallowed it. Give him a kiss. Ruben, you on there? Yeah. What is that? That's All a, the kids want to know. That's a tumor. <laughs> a tumor. A money tumor. A little guy right here. He's going to be at. Yeah, he's a keeper. 14 inches. 15. Oh, right at 14. I threw him, gotta be 15. I don't know. I think 14. All right, man, so I just hooked it to this real nice red. Sorry, I had it on my phone because this battery just died. So I had to get my phone, I had to get my phone out. So let's check it out. Let's check out this fish real fast. Look at my pliers. What's up, Joe? What's up? How you doing, bro? How's it going? Good. Uh, let's see what this guy looks like. I see him out here. Oh, man, he got some messed up eye. Yeah, I see him. Let's see how big he is. You get, can you get my phone and take a picture with me? Yeah. He is just missed 25. We're we'll gonna call it 25. Where your phone? It's still right there. Where? Yeah, you set it down. That's a nice fish right there. Oh, I got a fish on! I got a fish on! I was just playing around, bouncing it. <clears throat> Oh, look at this. All right. Ugh. Shark bait. There you go. That's a nice one. That's a sheephead. Hey. I'm going to keep that. I've been wanting to eat those sheep. Oh, no. You threw your rattle trap off? Oh. He snagged that thing. That's painful. Boy, I got the sheep. Uh, Norton. See that head shaking. I just lost some line too. I hope I got it out. Fish sticks rod. Oh yeah. Fish sticks on there, man. I have to do that. Um, hey, reach around here in a second. Eric, huh? reach. Oh, come on, help bro. him. Come help him. Hold on. Oh, he gonna step, bro. Don't get your ass pulled in. Hey. Oh yeah. Trying to head out to sea. He is trying to head out. Trying to head out. Glad he didn't go underneath the dock. There he is. 
They always get that burst of energy again right at, when they hit the surface. Huh? Bring him to the hole. Yeah. <laughs> Air looks good like that. <laughs> he uh -huh. Now he found that extra, that set of energy. Yeah. Burst of energy. He saw, he saw Eric with that net. <laughs> saw our soul. That's it. We living it every day. We're out here living it. Every day. Every day. Oh, that's a pretty one. That's a real pretty one. I'm going to get him up. Oh, yeah. You coming up? Oh, yeah. There it goes. Come on, Joe. Come on. Oh, he's, oh, he's going back ready. down. Don't let him go on the dock. There he is. There he is. There he is. Bring that little tank over here. There he is. You don't want to go. You don't want to go. Oh no, we're down. That boy don't like yeah. the net. He went down. Oh. There he goes. Oh, he went down again. Don't let him rub. The barnacles, too many barnacles on those floats. Here you go. There we go. Yeah. Joe got the double dot on the yeah. tail. Good job, you. buddy. If you don't know Joe, now you know. Yeah. Mr. Surfer out here. Oh, yeah. There you go. Uh, that's that. That's a that, good color. Is that Norton you said? Yeah, Norton. Uh, Norton. What's that jig head? It's a uh, Redfish Magic, man. Okay. Yeah. You got your phone All on? right, so that's going to do it. You know, I just came out real fast this morning. Eric got into a couple fish yesterday. The surf is a little green. It's not... It's not really clean, but it's a little green, little green hue. So when you start getting away from that brown color is when those specks, the bite for the speckle trout really turn on. Now yesterday he caught a couple fish. I think he caught a few sheephead and a couple of flounder. The wind overnight was supposed to die, so we were all thinking it was gonna flatten out. And even if you have some flatter waves and you still have that green hint, that green hue, you're still gonna get into the fish. Now, my buddy Cody, he caught a jack yesterday, a jackfish off the rocks. I'm gonna get that video for you guys very soon. I gotta get it off his phone. But he caught a jack off the rocks yesterday, so that was like super cool. A nice school rolled up, and there's no way to predict that. Sometimes the jacks roll through, and you just get lucky, and you happen to be at the right spot. So after we fished the surf this morning, with really just catching smaller stuff, we bought some small shrimp, live shrimp. Oh, that was small. And, you know, we went out there cast for a few hours. And then I wanted to change it up and go fish my uh, friend of mine's private docks. So we went over there and caught that nice red. Our friend Joe came out and he caught a nice fish too, as you saw. Eric caught a nice sheep head. You know, just kind of kind of a hang, hang out day, really. You know, burn the morning. It's about midday now, so I gotta go. Got some stuff I gotta take care of. So, hey, but... I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Giving a thumbs up. Leaving a comment, whether it's a good or bad comment. It really helps the channel out a lot. YouTube sees that and sees that everybody's interacting, everybody's watch time. So it really helps me and helps the channel out a lot. So please do that. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Thank you guys again. Hopefully next time you catch me.